hello guys welcome back to my channel in today's video we're going to look at how to put an image or a video in a text in canva using our smartphone we're going to do the examples that are showing up on your screen right now so if you're new to my channel please subscribe and turn on the notification bell so you always be notified when we drop a new video see you in the tutorial all right guys so welcome to the tutorial i'm going to be using the canva website not the application so this is the canva website the home page of the website all right so these are some options canva showing me canva showing me some options instagram post stories uh, we've gone through if you've not been through the introductory video to canva you can check the link in my description you will get to see all these um templates or how i explain them all right so to create a, put a video in your text or a picture in your text you need to just know what you want to do so definitely click, click on the plus sign and then let's decide what we want to do we can take custom size and create our page but i want us to do it like to have the size of a presentation so we're going to click on presentation because it has a format of a youtube video okay 16 by 9 all right now when you do that you're going to have this pop up elements or templates will pop up for you to edit but we're not going to use that so this is our design page setup and if you're going to do like a video with multiple scenes all you need to do is click, click here to add an extra scene when i click you see more page so you can a video will play here from first scene to scene two to scene three but we just need one scene for this exercise now i'll change the color of my background i'll touch on my background and change the color to black That's it. Okay, now let's go and get the letters we want to put our picture or video in. So one thing we're about to learn how to use very well here is called the frame. So you go to your elements. You want to learn how to use the Canva frames. Without the frames, you will not be able to do the exercise. So you can search frames when you click on elements. So these are canva frames frames are video and picture holders okay they hold your picture or your video so we're going to scroll through the frames and then we'll get the frames we need so i'm going to do a video which says good morning but i'm going to spell good morning and i put video in the letter so i'm going to start with the letter g and i reduce the size to do what i want I click again on my plus sign and when i do that it will just take me to my element and straightly to frames because these are the, the elements i'm currently using okay plus sign takes me to frames letter o plus sign letter o again or you can just go back to the element and you duplicate the first one okay the O plus sign letter M. Remember, these are frames, they're not just letters, they are frames. Sorry, it's letter D we need to take first. Letter D, it's good morning. We're trying to, to do letter D. Okay, so now you can control uh, adjust the size for it to fit uh, the size you want. All right, so let's go now to letter M. Click on my plus sign. I want to get letter M. Which is, then I'll take it here. I'll reduce the size. You know, I'm reducing the size by clicking on these edges. Okay, to this size move my elements with this you can rotate it with this but we don't need any of the rotation so it's mostly put reduce the size good morning i'll click on one of the o frames and then i click on duplicate so i have another one so i can put down here then i click from my plus sign and i get with the arrow the arrow frame it's not just letter and I reduce the size. OK, 
okay put it like that now next one is letter n next one is letter i one good thing is that once you open uh, the frame elements or some elements you're using when you click on your plus sign it goes straight to it unless you don't want to use those elements anymore you have to change so when i click again on my plus sign what else do i need i think i need n again n yeah morning or i could equally go to this one and i click on duplicate and i duplicate it okay and i can go to letter g up there i click on duplicate and i take a g frame from there good morning i think this arrow is a little bit big uh, oh, reducing it too much okay so we spelled good morning with these frames spell good morning with this frame so one thing that i want us to do now oh this is i want to separate this all from this a little, so just a little bit good all right so this is what i want we've had our our good morning written out with the frames letter frames so now we need to bring in the picture i want to put in now we'll click on our plus sign it will take us to flame to the frames so we're going to this is elements we are using element frames so we're going to leave there and we'll go to uploads if the picture are the pictures you want like from your gallery or pictures you want to upload to canva and use you go to uploads if you want photos from canva you go to photos so let's go to uploads and see sample of my picture these are some of my designs my pictures uh, that i uploaded from my phone into my website so i can take anyone can take anyone i can take like uh, this picture of myself in school way back in ubi and for me to put this picture in any of the frames all i need to do is put my finger on the picture put my finger on the picture and move it to the letter that i want it will get inside the letter that's just it as simple as that so i will undo that and then i can duplicate it and put it inside so each time i touch on my picture i will duplicate it and i put it duplicate and put it duplicate and put it so you just have to do this process the reason why i want to duplicate it, i duplicate because i don't want to put my picture and then i have to go and take it back all the way from upload so i just duplicate it and put it duplicate it and put it duplicate it and take it to the letter okay that's just it duplicate the picture and put it duplicate the picture and put it now you can delete the last one so that is all you have your picture in your in the letters okay that's just it but now to say you can easily save this you click up here and you click on download they are giving you pdf format standard but i want to save it as a picture so i'll click on options so you go to download you click here you have download options so i would like to download it as a png image if i click there i'll have that design in my phone it will be downloaded in my phone but this is not what i want so now i'm going to take off all of them all the pictures and let's do what i want so that is one that's how you put your pictures in letters now i want to put videos if you also want to use your own videos you make sure you go to upload and you go to your videos and you take the videos from your device if you don't have it here these are videos from my device if i want videos from my phone i'll click on me upload media i'll go and get the video from my phone if i click on upload media it will take me to my device i will go there and i choose where go to my files and i choose which video 
I'll bring it to Canva and then put it in my text. But I want to use Canva video. That's the thing. I want to use videos from Canva. So we're going to go to videos. So we use Canva videos. I don't want to use my own videos. And I love this particular video of this man. So I'm going to click on it. You can equally go to Canva videos and search the videos, video like video categories, their area shots, nature, there are different categories of videos here. So you can equally go there and you search rain, sky, you search some videos have sound, cities, see some don't. So you can go there and you play around and look for the video you want. So I'm just all people where you see videos of people talking or doing one thing or the other. But I like this video. This is uh, the video I use a lot. All right, so let's get back to it. Now I have the video on my design. I have the video on my design. So that is there you go. Right, so this is it. I want to put this video in all of these text. So first, I want to, since the video is big, I want to reduce the size of the video. I want to reduce the size of the video so that I can see my screen very well. Okay. So all you need to do is hold, touch the video and you drag it to any of the letters and it will get inside it. As simple as that. But I want to do it and also I'll be duplicating it. Take the duplicate and I put in the letter. Click on duplicate, put on the letter. The duplicate button when you touch on your video the duplicate button is right here right here so i'll just touch it duplicate it and i'm going to do this very fast duplicate 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 and I put in the N duplicate and I put in the G duplicate you can see there's equally a play sign up here for you to play see your video how it how it's playing so and I put in letter I so I've I've done what I want and I put all the I put the video in all the letters and now I can download it I can download it as a picture and I can download it as a video so I want to download this as a picture equally I can add my name scroll down all right now I want to add my name like a tag down here a like good morning from Beckham's graphics okay so I'll click on the plus sign and I go to text all right and then I'll take body text I'm going to take body text and I'll have a little body text down here now the body text is black so I'll scroll through and give my body text a white color and then I'll go to edit to edit my text so I type from becomes graphics and then we're done All right, so that is it. Let me put this one down like that. Okay. There you go. So that is it about putting video or picture in a text. So now I can animate the letters 
my favorite animation when i highlight any of the letters my favorite animation is this you scroll through and you go to animate my favorite animation is tumble okay so i'm going to give these letters a particular way of coming i want all of them to have tumble so i'll touch each letter and i touch tumble animation there is also one animation that i like storm letter n i'll give it the storm animation so automatically we're doing a video because you're animating your element and i give letter g storm so this is what is going to happen when you're actually doing that i think i should give this letter o storm so now i go to my small text i touch it and i give it an animation of my choice i can give it type right or i give it ascent so but i love typewriter so that's it now we're done putting your fit your picture and your uh, your video in your text using uh canva text frames so let's save it as a picture and as a video so we're done you get up here you click on it you click on download now they tell you pdf standard pdf is for document so we don't want that we want png high quality image so i'll click on that and i click on download canva preparing the design and it is done it's now in my gallery now i want to save it as an image i go back to my button click on download click on the arrow to open my download options and i click on mp4 video and then i click on download Canva is doing the magic. We're almost done. Almost done. Almost done. Come on. Perfect. And now we are done. Our video has been downloaded, so we are done. You can go to your gallery now and check your video so first this is the video play it so that is the video we just did okay and let's check the picture And this is the picture so guys thanks for watching if you find this video helpful give this channel 